hello guys uh, this is Shaw and in this video I will show you how you can get the on-screen keyboard on your Droid box uh, a lot of users when they try to search something on their Droid box browser or maybe Chrome app and uh, sometimes they want to enter the password for their Wi-Fi and uh, they try to check uh, their remote and they don't see the alphabets or the other characters that they have in their password and they don't also see the on-screen keyboard which makes a really frustrating situation for a customer uh, they try to check their remote they try to check on the TV screen but there is no on-screen keyboard so uh, they try to think that maybe the box is faulty or they want to return the box or something but let me tell you that there is nothing wrong with the box if you don't see an on-screen keyboard it is just a setting that you need to turn on and you will see uh, the on-screen keyboard so as an example on this box uh, if I try to uh, I don't have my internet connected so I will try to go into Wi-Fi and try to connect the internet so I go into my Wi-Fi option so after that when I try to go into Wi-Fi and it's telling me to enter a password but it's not showing me an on-screen keyboard and I'm using an infrared remote that comes by default with the Droid box, so it is very difficult for me to enter anything unless there is there are only numbers in the password. Then of course I can enter it uh, with the with the normal IR remote. But if there are letters and special characters, then I need the on-screen keyboard. So in order to get the on-screen keyboard up and running, what you need to do is first thing start your box as normal and then from the home screen go on the go on the settings option the two cogs so I am selecting the two cogs the settings option I'm clicking OK on this and now it takes me to this screen and from here I will go on to the option onto the tab named as other and from there I will go on to more settings option and I will click OK I've clicked OK and now it has presented me with this screen uh, which is black on the background and there are some options that it presents us and from here we can go into Option which is called as language and input you can see at the bottom There's an option called as language and input I will go into language and input and in there there is another option that we need to go on to Which is known as default you can see here there is default English US Android keyboard AOSP I will click OK on this and it will open up a pop-up window and you can see here in this pop-up window it is showing choose input method so it has hardware physical keyboard is on and this should be turned off when the hardware physical keyboard is off it will show us the on-screen keyboard so right now I have selected this the hardware physical keyboard uh, the on um, button is selected and I will press OK now on my uh, normal IR remote and it has taken me back to this to the screen now I will again go into this option I will check whether this has been turned off and you can see the hardware physical keyboard is now off so now I expect that it should show me the on-screen keyboard so in order to check we will again go into our Wi-Fi and we will try to input the password and see if we get the on-screen keyboard so I'm I'm connecting to my uh, Wi-Fi which is Wi-Fi hot I'm clicking OK on it you can see now now it's showing me the on-screen keyboard at the bottom and before when I tried to access and try to try to enter the password it was not showing any keyboard uh, on the bottom of the screen so now it is showing the on-screen keyboard and you can uh, use the on-screen keyboard to input the password for example if my password is uh, D-E-R-E key E and K direct my password is direct one two three so and for example if there are numbers or special characters please use um, the bottom left corner option where there is question mark and one two three if I click on that it will show me uh, numbers and uh, special characters like the plus or the minus uh, and other options also the hash key the dollar sign if you need those for your password uh, so I will click three two one and if there's a hash key in my password I will 
press the hash key so you can see there are all the options present on the on-screen keyboard so i think this is it for this video so uh, in case there's no on-screen keyboard on your device please follow the video it's pretty descriptive and it's very easy to follow so thanks for watching this video and i will be back with more videos thank you bye bye